Hello, hello. What is going on? So, uh, just got the audio set up, configured, and um, what I wanted to do is uh, I've got these recordings of these games that I play. Um, I wanted to add some commentary to to kind of explain like uh, you know, what's going on, why I'm doing the things I do, uh, you know, pass along those uh, tips and tricks, so to speak. So that would be the goal of this, and the reason why you're hearing my voice. So uh, I can leave notes to myself for the future, or uh, if someone else ends up with these VHS tapes, they can uh, you know, gain, gain certain insights. So let's get started. We're going to play some Bonk's Revenge. And uh, first things first, we've got to pick a mode. We're not doing practice mode because it's only one stage. Intermediate, similar, but it's four. We're going to do the complete game, expert mode. Um, because I'm an expert. I consider myself an expert gamer. So let's get into it. Let's see what uh, let's see what awaits me here. So this get my points, dude. A thousand points. I've got a little insider knowledge here. I played this game when I was younger, and uh, I know certain certain Easter eggs and secrets that I'll be walking everyone through. And uh, something to keep in mind is that when you see these, uh, these little fruit things or whatever, um, make sure you bonk them first because they might turn into, you know, like a yellow one that you could jump on like I did just there, or a blue one, which is a one-up. A lot of possibilities with those guys, so just make sure you're, uh, you're bonking them before you jump on them. And we're going to get into this challenge here. Oh. It's not too bad. Ah! Oh my god. So embarrassing. Uh, I don't know, normally that challenge isn't very difficult, but <laughs> you know, you get you get humbled by many things. Uh, I've learned. No worries though. Um, the whole point of those challenges is to like collect the smiley faces. But um you know, the rewards associated with smiley faces, you mostly just use it to get more health. But if you get like 50 in a level, you'll get a 1-up and a couple other little perks. It's not essential though. Really, you just need to get 30. And I have 4. So we're, uh, we're on our way. Oh. Ability. Grab a secret. Alright, let's try not to screw this one up like the other one. Ah, the glacier one. Okay, this one is another test of skill, but I don't believe it's very difficult. forward on the ice, you have to do these like little short hops. See me do? Cause you to slide forward. Oh, and then I landed on my head too. That's the. Uh, I imagine that when speedrunners are doing this, they land on their head. It's just kind of a trick. It's a neat trick. But yeah, that challenge, not all that difficult. Go ahead and get the 10 smileys there. Makes up for our uh, <laughs> mistake that we made on the last one. Not the end of the world, though. Oh, my. Wow. Oh, crazy, dude. Take care of this boss really quick. Mini boss. Becomes a normal enemy later in the game, but for now it kind of functions as a boss. Straight up here. A couple secrets that we want to grab. Some more meat up here. 
So at the time of filming this, I'm vegetarian, but um, you know, when it comes to eating meat in video games, I like to make a rare exception. Um, so that's why <clears throat> you see that I don't have any qualms with the eating the meat. It's a function of the game, there's not really much I can do about it. I could do a vegetarian playthrough. I might record that at a later date. Um, I haven't decided. Ah! You mother muchacho. I was gonna say, you probably noticed that I didn't uh, do anything with that. Ah. With that fruit on the right. That was because I knew it was a. Uh, oops. I knew that it was one of those little anchor things. But he got out anyways. Oh man. I don't know if there's a way to do this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. That was... I got free eye there. Oh, there we go. Dang, it's making the video. I need to stop, but... Uh... Ooh, that was, that was basically it. This is not very producing to uh, entertain the viewers. That's what, that's what I try to do. Okay, come on. <laughs> you got this, bro. I want those three smileys, dude. <laughs> those three smileys can make or break my... Ugh. Ooh, that was so close. Basically, you have to, like... You have to get the highest edge of it. Sayonara to those smiley faces. It would be pretty chill if I had them, but it's definitely not the end all be all here. Especially owing to the fact that I have 16 right now. We've got at least two more challenges on this level, if not three. Which will get me the 30 that I need. I, I think I'm not in contention to get the 50 because I messed up that first one, but we'll get the 30. Midway bonus, which I'll show you later. Nope. Ah! Oh, I messed that one up. It's alright though, we don't need a perfect, we just need all the smileys. That's what I'm going for. Nope. You know what makes it hella hard if you. Ah! If you uh, hit a lava and it ended, that would be much more difficult. As it stands, though, you can get you can take some damage on those, which is not very difficult. Oh, this piranha one. This is like I, I don't even understand how this works. It's like a timing or something. how it works, but I still got six. I think that's the highest I've ever gotten on that. Usually I get uh, between zero to two, I think. The two being the last two that you saw me pick up there. But I did pretty well there. Not bad at all. Take advantage of this little flying thing that we have. A couple smileys that we can grab here. Scoop them up, dude. Scoopa. King Scoopa. Alright. What do we got next here? Nice. Dodge the bullet there. Normally I get hit by those, but. Oh man, this is. Okay. 
I'm gonna turn on the auto fire mode for the B button, which is the button that lets you bonk. So basically I can just hold it down and it'll do that. Um, normally I mash it, but it's just like, you know what, I'm not trying to exert extra force, it's not necessary. Oh yeah, dude, look at this shit. Dude, this is on, I don't even curse it. Uh, look at this stuff, this is on easy mode right now. I'm just holding down the button. I have so much control over where I go. If you let go of it, you can uh, bank uh, in one direction pretty quickly. But it's not even necessary if you're doing it like this, because you're moving at like, basically the minimum speed. Yep, 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 yep. As it was, as it were, as it shall be. Look at that, boom. Got it all, perfect score. Boom. I hit on my head too, it's very stylish. Stylish ending to that minigame. That was a 10-10, that was perfect. Um, pop quiz, how many smileys do I have? Do you know? Do you know how many smileys I have? I'm willing to check. I want to say I have 26. What? 42? Dang, bro. It's like a hell of more than I thought I had. Range of the bonk, dude. Not that great. Okay, I'm pretty sure. So the developers of the game, they they like to set you up for failure. If you ever see anything above one of those fruits, it's probably gonna turn into one of those little anchor enemy things. So uh, my advice would be to. Uh -oh. Oh, wow. oh yeah, I was gonna say that's a damn shame if I lost that, but. I get to take heavy advantage of it. Okay, I was saying, um, like, look at this. So, see how there's this thing that's above the uh, fruit? I'm pretty sure what's going on here is that this is going to turn into a anchor. Yep, and I lost my thing, which kind of sucks. Um, not a big deal, though. So yeah, that's something to just keep an eye out for. If you ever see anything above one of those fruits, just like try not to jump on the fruit because it's there's a pretty good chance that there's a just one of those things that's gonna come out and try to mess you up, make you lose a heart or something. Okay, so 45 smileys. That's actually pretty close to the 50. I'm kind of bummed that uh, we messed it up. I messed it up in the way that I did. So I didn't mean to implicate you, the viewer. <laughs> in this scenario, but yeah, it's quite unfortunate, really. Oh, man. <laughs> man every time I do that, I like, uh, next to video, that was weird. Uh, my physical reactions to the game. But as you can see, the main strategy with this guy is you just want to uh, do, the, do the drop and then press B like, as quickly after as you can so that you can chain those hits. It takes like 12 hits to kill him, or 10 maybe, which is not very challenging if you uh, can time it correctly. If you're doing them one at a time, it's probably going to take forever to kill him. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm lightweight upset about that, but at the same time, not too worried. See how I got the blue before the red too? That's a sort of a pro tip that I can offer. Uh, you want to get the heart before you get healed. That's, that's the way you want to do it. Mm. See, that's not like one that you'd think would turn into an enemy. <laughs> like that. The ones that turn, to, that turn into enemies are sometimes difficult to bomb because you have to jump on them. And it puts you in a precarious position when you have to you know, try to fight for it. Anchor, whatever the heck that thing is. I'm not really sure what technology that is. Oh. Alright, look at this. This is an arrow. We're gonna follow, we're gonna heed the advice, follow the advice the developers provided us in the form of that arrow. Go ahead and jump on there and uh, begin this next challenge stage. This one, it's kind of RNG, 
I want to say that it's a free 10-10, but you can get messed up if you, uh, I don't know, if one of the lava things falls into it too, or if you accidentally land on your head. That one was kind of tough. Oh! Ah! Dang it! Ah! Wow. Yeah, so that's that's another thing that you gotta kind of be wary of too, is that, um... Uh, you gotta have good control over your character. If you don't have good control, you're gonna make mistakes like that. But there's a secret up here, so that's why we're going this way. Um, to get a heart. Which is pretty chill, considering that those are kind of far and few between. Another bonus stage here that we're going to try out. Hopefully not screw up too bad. I mean, I got five. I got five some out. Oh, man. This one's... This one's got weird timing. Basically, you have to... You press the bonk button. Turn off the auto player. You press the bonk button when you're next to the wall and it jumps up. It's not bad, but it's just like... You kind of have to be patient with it, especially during this part. Ooh! <laughs> with zero seconds left. Did you see that? That was epic, bro. That was epic. I don't even know how I did that. And you notice how I didn't rush all the way to the top. In the last one, I went down a little bit, and I did an extra one. So I'd end up on the left instead of the right. And that's because the smiley was on the right. And if you go on the left, it ends the, ends the mission. Uh, it's not a mission, but it ends the um, stage. So yeah, I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised that I finished it. Normally I get most of the way through, but sometimes you can mess up, because like, the same button that you press to bonk off the wall or whatever is the one that does this, and basically just makes you drop straight down. So if you do that on accident, instead of bonking the wall, you basically just like lose. Oh, that was a too a premature, dude. A little preemptive. Ooh, I'm so curious about the high ceiling on this level. It's like sometimes I do that bonk and I end up pretty high up. It makes me wonder if there's like something up there. Maybe like, I don't know, time it right or something. Maybe you can like get to the ceiling. I don't know what's going on. I have no idea. Oh. Heal up. Grab this. Take those. We take those every day of the week. Boom, boom, boom. I don't think so, dude. Not today, dude. There you go. You take them out. It's a safe, it's a safe way to deal with that. Uh, with those shenanigans. Look at that, dude. Would you look at that? Tell what stage is this, dude? Oh, dude, we're gonna turn on we're turning on auto fire mode. <laughs> auto fire mode enabled. <laughs> um, Cause yeah, I'm like I'm not messing around with this. Okay, all right. So that's one of the potential problems with auto fire is that we have less control over uh, the direction that you're traveling. But as you can see, I was able to regain the control necessary and. Uh, do, do what I need to do to get this uh, this perfect 10-10. 10 fruit, 10 smileys, 
10 things that I love. Or 20 things, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yep. There you go. There you have it. There you have it, folks. Oh man, didn't land on my head. That would've been sick. It's all good, though. I'm not sure. Uh, yeah. Hi, can I get a smiley check, please? <laughs> Let me dial 1-800-SMILEY, <laughs> see if anyone picks up. Alright, we got 33. We got 33, so we're chillin', dude. We're chillin'. Nope. 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 Panic. Panic bonk does not result in anything positive happening. Oh, man, it's a tight song. And we're chillin', dude. Ugh. This, this mother muchacho, dude. I don't think so, dude. I don't think so, bro. Not today, dude. There you go. Pretty sure there's one more. No, there's not. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right, we're gonna make a we're gonna make our move here. Oh, dude, smiley, smiley city, dude. Smiley heaven, dude. Smiley Haven. 38, dude. I think we're poised to hit the 50. I messed up on one of them. I think it was the one where they fall from the sky or whatever. But I think we're still we're still in a good position to get 50. One of the other perks of getting with getting 50 is you get to skip uh, the following stage. So we might get to skip the ice stage, which kind of bummed about because it has a cool cool theme. There's a cool song there. Whoa, that was weird. But uh you know, that's that kind of stuff oh that kind of stuff happens. Where you skip the level and you never listen to the cool song. There's plenty of cool songs though, so it's not that big of a deal. this up, we can end up with 48? Damn, that's close. I don't know if that's going to be it, though. Oh. Okay. We dotto, dude. Oh. Nice. Short hop, short hop. Oh, whoa. Oh my god. Damn, that was hella tight. <laughs> I thought I lost it, and I panicked and I pressed B, and it. Oh, you know what? It's on the auto fire, bro. I don't know if that even had an impact on it at all. Probably didn't, but still. Still panicking, because that's what I do. Oops. Uh, look at this, dude. Look at this. Look at these developers. Oh, we're gonna put fruit right on top of these things, and uh, you know the gamer's gonna actually jump on them and end up having to deal with an enemy. Nope. I'm going right around, dude. Right around it. Right, what is over here? Anything interesting? Another mini game, maybe? I got 47, bro. I got 47 smileys and counting, dude. Oh my gosh, dude! No way. Another mini game. Oh, this one's hella weird. This one's weird, but I can definitely get three from it. You have to like, uh, see one of them. It's like playing whack-a-mole, dude. <laughs> wow. I got two, dude. Are you kidding me? I'm at 49, dude. I guess you can't get hurt or something. That, that implies, dude. I wonder if there's a single. Oh my god. Look at that, dude. Look at that, bro. <laughs> I have 49 and there's one right there. It's like I'd be a fool not to grab that one. I would be a fool. I'd be remiss, dude. I would be a reminisced. Dude. Oh, but. One of those, dude. Pop them up, dude. Pop them up. 
sorry, I've been playing a little Smash Bros, so I got the, uh, the language is translating over very well. Oop. There you go, dude. Whoa. What the hell? What the hell? How am I gonna deal with this guy? Oh, there we go. That's how you deal with that guy, dude. That's how you do that. Alright, we're chilling. So we got 50. We got 50 smileys, which is legit, dude. That's uh, that's gonna get us our level level skip, dude. Level oh whoa. Man, get the shut the front door, bro. If he can do, he does a lot of damage. He can hit you with his, with the horn. The horn has a hitbox that deals different damage. I think it does like three hearts or something. As you can see, that would have killed me if I would have got hit by it. But we got our 50. We're chilling. We're trucking along, dude. Doing what we gotta do. Doing what we do best. Drink to that, dude. Ba -ba -ba. Not one up, dude. What a battle. I concur, dude. I'm willing to concur on that front. There we go, dude. Level warp, bro. What's up? We're starting round four. Look at this, dude. Freeze, freezing time. Watch out for the surfers. I'm not even worried about the points, dude. The puntas, dude. It's, I've got bigger fish to fry. Now, I'm not just saying that because we're on the beach level right now, dude. Damn, go to the tire. Alright, what, uh... Oh, this is that radar one. This one's kind of... Kind of lame. You gotta just, like, uh... Ooh, look at that, dude. You gotta, like, uh, really be smart with this one. Because if you if you destroy the radars and you land, it finishes it. So, like, uh, like, if you still have some left on the right or whatever, start on the left. Um, and I think if you take damage, you lose. And then, obviously, you fall. You lose. So there's a lot of room for error there, but um, somehow you have to come out on top. Guys, I don't even know. What are you gonna mash out of this, dude? What's that? Oh, the warship hold, dude. We're taking, we're taking the fight to them, dude. Apparently the, oh, uh, apparently the dinos have a navy, dude. They've assembled. Assemble the ship, the shipments. Um, so that's that's where we're going. We're going to the ship's hold. Getting familiar with the underwater mechanic, which ends um, up ends up being a little bit more prominent later in the game. So another underwater level. Pretty short, but we'll, uh, we'll get out of there while we can. Moving on here, moving up. Moving out, dude. Moving into it. Moving and grooving. We're making our moves. Here. I'm just 
smileys do I have? I only got 10, bro. I only have 10, but this is the only 10 you could have, I think. Oh, oh no. So we're going for another 10 here. We're gonna see what challenge we get. Glaciers, maybe? No. Oh. Avoiding the fireballs, of course. And then remember, you gotta stay, stay in the middle if you can. The middle just is the best place to uh, throw the edge in. Because yeah, from the middle you can get to the other side Wah! pretty quickly. So that's why I try to stay in the middle when I'm doing this one. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Dang, every time I yell, it like <laughs> it makes the video get weird. I don't know why that is. Dang. Well, you know what? That's kind of that kind of upsets me that I. Just one away from getting the perfect score. But, you know what, dude? You know what? That kind of stuff happens and you can't let it get to your head. Because I'm still playing... I'm playing Boxer Revenge and having a great time, dude. It's not necessary for me to uh, do perfect in every challenge. I didn't do it in the first mission stage. And I might not do it on this one. And it's chill, dude. It's all chill. Up there, dude. Oh wow, I barely made it on that one. Uh, this, I, the, this mechanic is just kind of strange. I understand how it works, but uh, it's like, it wants you to overcommit and then screw up. But I didn't screw it. It wanted me to, but it, I didn't. I got 20 for it, not even 10, dude. Give me all those points, bro. Look it up, dude. 10k. $10,000, dude. What are we at? 29? 29's good. That's some good stuff. That's some good stuff right there. Oh, no, no. There you go, dude. Oh, I wonder if you can, like, uh, like, do something where you go up there. I don't know, I don't know. I'm already down here, so I'm going to try it. But I'm curious, because I'm always exploring the verticality, dude. It's, it's in my nature to uh, explore the verticality. Oh my gosh, it's taking forever. This dude out, dude, snipe him. Sniper wolf style. Also known as the Gimp. Oh, that's a weird timing. Alright, we're good. We're good. Oh, what the hell? Where'd my fruit go? Your boy's hungry, dude. Your boy's hungry for some fruit. I need to get my, uh, all my vitamins, dude. Minerals, bro. I don't know where that came from. This guy, this guy. Nope. Okay. That, that's one way to do it. It's sloppy, but it's not that bad. Right, we're going up. We're going up. And we're going over. Who is this one? Uh, glaciers. Glaciers, not bad. Bonus stage number six. Hop through the glaciers. Thirty. I could get perfect on this. No big deal, dude. 
No big deal, bro. Oh yeah, dude. Oh yeah, bro. Alright, we're probably more than halfway through. Oh yeah, this is the last part. Oh! Oh my god! Oh! Damn, bro! So close, dude! So close. Sorry, I gotta stop shouting. I can see that it's, uh... I can see that it's clipping. Oh! See it's clipping and that's not that's not the kind of message I'm trying to send, dude. Because what's important in games like this is to stay uh is to stay calm, cool, and collected. Uh, and that's what I'm gonna do. I'm staying calm, cool, and collected. I'm collecting something. And yeah, we're still in a great position to finish with 50 because I picked up that one smiley. And there's probably a couple lying around on this level too. I wouldn't put it past I wouldn't put it past NEC, the developer, to uh to have left, you know, additional smileys and, you know where they see fit. So we're chilling, dude. We're chilling like a villain. Get out of here, dude. I don't want any of that, bro. Secret hidden mission over here in the corner. I'm gonna check your corners. Oh, dude, this one's this one is not bad. I don't want to guarantee that I'm gonna get a perfect, but I think I got this, bro. I think I got this. Easy money. I'm cashing that check, bro. <laughs> Thank you very much for the Visa gift card and Smiley's, dude. I'd like to make a withdrawal from the bank of Smiley, please. Yeah, what do you mean insufficient funds? I said the bank of Smiley. Alright, dude, we got 50. Wow, that's... You know what? I'm kind of... I'm, I'm feeling great about that. First off, yeah, I'm just going to come back to this. I don't have patience to sit around and not these things. It's all good, bro. It's all good. Dude. You get iframes, bro. I'm all about the iframes. Wow, that was... I finished with 51. That's crazy. That's crazy. Alright, now we gotta fight Captain... Captain something or other. The Admiral, dude. The Admiral this week. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna lose a life, bro. <laughs> the way that you want to approach that guy. I legit have no idea how you're supposed to attack this guy. Normally I just take damage until I get on top of him and then I use that downward bomb. Maybe that's my end? Where you get behind him? Certainly not behind him. What is this guy supposed to be like a... They're all dinosaurs, but he doesn't look like a dinosaur to me. Damn. I'm alright with it, dude. It's okay. You gotta you gotta break eggs to make an omelet, bro. There you go. There you have it, folks. Brute. That's uh, not an inaccurate description of uh, the character named Box. And we're riding all the way to the top, baby. If I get another level warp, that means I have to skip. Uh, what level is that? Wow. 
lava fields or something? Uh, that one sucks, so if I get to skip it, I'm stoked. That's, that one is uh, nothing, but, nothing but trouble. Look at that, full health, dude. What a battle. What a battle it was, dude. Level warp. Warping it. This is kind of a uh, Super Mario Bros. mechanic. Um, sort of like how you could skip stages in the secret, uh, secret area. And then, yeah, dude, I can skip the lava fields. That place sucks. So I'm stoked, dude. I'll do, I'll do what I gotta do. Whoa. This is not something that I foresaw. That I foresuck, dude. What though, dude? I see. I see more meat up here, dude. My perception, dude. I have nine or ten perception, dude. It's almost maxed out. Get out of my life, bro. Wow, that's sick, dude. That's so sick. Oh, I don't know what that was all about, though. Keep an eye out for these things. Have you seen any glass? Uh, usually it's a sign that... What the heck, dude? I think there's like supposed to be one up down there, but I... I accidentally uh, released it with my... my powerful... whatever that was. Ooh, that's sick, bro. Dino, Dino Lake, dude. Kind of like a, sort of a Dino Crisis, dude. <laughs> kind of a Dino Crisis in the mix, dude. Ooh, uh oh. Oh no. Ah, wow, I'm like, I'm so lucky that I didn't lose this thing. Because that's the only way to get up here that I know of. Alright. And they're done with bonus stages, dude. Collecting smileys? Nah. Nah, bro. That is that is so, like, uh, stages one through four. Like, we're just gonna... Can you find one of these? We're just gonna hook it up, dude. And that's exactly what they do. Look at this. One up. Heal. Full heal. Ooh, it, ooh. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Lucky number 13, dude. We're chilling. Such a sick technique, dude. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm, I'm kind of feeling myself here, dude. Right. Okay. We're, uh, we're scooping up. We're scooping it up, dude. Going for that one up, dude. Dodging bullets here. <laughs> the helicopter, dude. <laughs> Operation Dino Storm. <laughs> um, so good. All right, here we go. Here we go, dude. Here we go. Oh, what, dude? Two hits. Two hits, dude. Too easy. Oh man, I didn't keep that thing though. That would have been chill, bro. That would have been so chill. Guys, real quick. Oh man, what the fudge dude? Oh my gosh, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. There you go. There you go. Like that, dude. It's like that, and uh. Stupid. I don't even know what that is, dude. Ah! Yep. 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 Yeah, I'm gonna have to work on the audio configuration because every time I yell, it like it makes the screen look a little weird. I don't know why that is. <laughs> Definitely should not have an impact on the video signal, but but it's happened every single time I've yelled, which is which has been quite a few times. Unfortunately, I'm sorry. 
I'm a passionate gamer. I'm a gamer of many passions. Um, but yeah, no idea what no idea what that's all about. Alright, we're heading up, dude. We're heading up. Up and in. Ah! <laughs> there it goes again, dude. Guilty as charged. There you go. Alright. Okay, let's not... There you go. Nice and smooth. Nice and smooth like butter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, oops. Yeah, what I want to do is, uh... Turn me out of fire. Rapid, the rapid descent, dude. Rapid ascent. I'm sorry. I think it's the top here. I think there's like a one-up or something. Or maybe some health. Oh, there you go. Yeah, you want to pick up the health and then you go. It didn't give me another heart! Did you see that? Did you see how it didn't give me another heart? BS, bro. Like, like WTF, bro. I do not approve. I do not approve of it not giving me another heart. I work hard for my hearts, dude. I work hard for my kingdom hearts, dude. And I prefer them to be, uh, yielded and not unyielded, as seen above. Okay, we're, uh, we're beginning our ascent here. Dun -dun. Lots of this, dude. Okay, lots of these stones, but guess what, dude? Don't have to mess with it. Don't have to mess with it, because I got, I got the powers that be, dude. And we're back. We are back to what we do best, dude. We're back in business. We're back. We're back with the bacon, dude. <laughs> oh, dodging bullets, dude. Matrix style. Alright, who's, uh, who's up next, dude? Who's next on the list? on my list. Oh, this guy. This guy's a pansy. He's not that hard at all. Oh, you know what, dude? I totally forgot. I had the A button set to auto fire so it didn't do the big jump. Oh! Oh! Quite unfortunate when I get hit. But yeah, the main strategy of this guy is... Wow. He could hit. You want to bait out that attack where he goes down, and then uh, you just jump and land on him. You can see I timed it there to where I'd get a second hit, but he's too quick. He has eye frames, and he does not get hit by the second hit. Oh, wow! Oh, wow, dude. Alright, there we go. There's a new mechanic we gotta do with his hands. It's not that difficult. Because you can just jump. Yeah, he's mostly just dealing damage to you when you, uh, when you whiff your, I guess you'd call it the escape. Ducking under him, essentially. But yeah, guy's not too bad. Not too bad. I, mean, I got zero smileys, dude. I got no smileys to show for that. I guess they didn't put smileys in this level because you don't ride an elevator at the end. You, like, take this rocket or whatever. You could have rode an elevator to the rocket, though. I don't know. So ominous. Uh, so yeah, this is just a stage where you basically go through these you know, challenging stages and um, fight bosses that you've already fought. That thing's kind of tight. But not too worried about this stage. It's not that bad, honestly. Right now, it's ridiculous. 
What is that even supposed to be? Just a big foot? Dinosaur foot? Oh my gosh, I can't believe I made it past that. Oof. What? No way. They're giving me a full heal, dude? If they're giving me a full heal, I'm taking it, bro. I'm taking those, dude. Yeah, we take those. Wow. Okay. I was looking for a secret up there, but... Ah, oh, man, this guy. she wrote, dude. That's all she had. Alright, that was, uh, I don't even remember what that level was called. Something like terror Tunnel or something. Oh, I think it was called Ambush something. Ambush Alley or something. <laughs> Helicopters again, which I get a little bit kick out of. Bubbles. Bubbles are dangerous to the prehistoric man. That's <laughs> what I've been able to surmise from uh, playing this game. Wow. Come on. Messing around, dude. I went for that heart, but I took damage to get it, so... <laughs> Broke even, probably. That's a weird guy. Ah, oh, man. I got this crap mechanic, dude. It's like, uh, that's so annoying. There you go. Alright, watch. I'm gonna pick up this blue heart. It's not even gonna give me jack, dude. Check this out. Nothing, dude. You should be able to get hella hearts, bro. Like, why can't you get hella hearts? Get yeah, Hello Hearts and Legend of Zelda. Where did that game come out, dude? Can I make a sick hi hat, maybe? Crab mode, crab mode enabled, dude. Oh no. Well, no, it's a one up. It's a one up, so we're going back for it, dude. And the, uh, the key strategy we're gonna employ is not getting hit by the water drop. What the hell, bro? Come on. There you go, dude. Right on the edge of the hitbox. Blue heart doesn't do a thing. Yeah, I worked my tail off grinding these uh, mini games so I could get the blue hearts there. And, uh, oh. You could have just, uh, ah, this is so annoying. Could have just gone here and gotten them for free, dude. Why even work hard? there for now. There's a reason why I'm gonna do that. And the reason is these helicopters. These guys, they don't mess around, dude. Unfortunately. <laughs> It'd be nice if they messed around. Yeah. It'd be nice if they messed around just a little bit, but maybe not. There's another helicopter, but I can deal with it. I can deal with it.
Oh, I cannot deal with it, allegedly. So done. I wasn't even going that free. Alright, who's who are we who are we dealing with here? Not bad. I'm gonna let him throw his hook out, because he stays out a lot longer when he does that. So that's a good strategy. It's a good strat. Shocker there. No surprises. Up next, we've got. Uh, oh man, this song is so terrible. I'm like definitely gonna sample this song. It's probably not even gonna turn out that sick because I'm not a good producer, but I'm gonna do it. It's a nice melody, dude. I just like that melody. come from piranha on the dolo dude on the dolo dude. I'm not trying to turn into a crab dude it's not my business dude I'm not in the business of turning into a crab oh wow how did I dodge that dude that was that was epic the crab crab crusher Definitely avoid. Oh, the hitbox is above it, but it's not very big, unfortunately. There you go. Oh man, crab mode. Crab mode enabled, crab mode disabled. What the heck, dude? Go down. Alright, what, 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 what the health, dude? <laughs> In that I'm saying, what the hell, there is no health on the stage. Literally zero healing items. I died, I died to heal. That's how you do it. Alright, so this is the boss that I skipped. I won't miss an hour much. Basically, she just goes left and right. You kind of have to jump when she gets close to you to get rid of that snowball. Pop. Yeah, that's one of the problems with this boss, though, is that uh, oops, um, if you get too close to her before she's like in her vulnerable state, you just get hurt. And the vulnerable state starts when the icicles start dropping, which I guess um, challenges you with the timing or something. Oh, come on, dude. What the hell, bro? This is ridiculous, dude. This is so ridiculous. Ah, this boss is fine. Ugh. 
Buh, indeed. B-U-H, dude. Buh. Look at that, I get hit every single time. Like, how the fuck else are you supposed to get up there? It's not like the other bosses where you can chain together the bonk attacks, because she gets hit once, and then she, like... Boss's domain. Spook tunnel. Scary. Very scary. The enemies that are hanging from chains, dude. It's pretty terrifying, actually. Spook tunnel for you, bro. Did that a little too early. But that's it. That was a, that was a short tunnel. But we are at the box. Alright, bro, what you got? Yeah, I pressed it too fast. He was still invulnerable when I tried to, uh... Chain because of the down attacks. Oh. But, that time he wasn't. Got him. Ah! Ah! Why does that affect the video quality? I'm so confused by that. don't get it, dude. I literally do not get it. Alright, this guy. <clears throat> this guy's not bad. Again, we're just beating out him coming down so that we can punish it. Whoa. Get plenty of time to punish it, as you can see. Ever coming down, bro. Oh my gosh. Did I miss that? We're chilling. We're chilling until he comes down again, dude. I'm taking a nap, bro. Foul, dude. Are you kidding me, bro? What the hell, dude? Definitely getting hit by this next attack. Oh. It's not. Wow. Barely. Barely holding on. I followed him up, dude. That's called follow-up. See what he does. Does it come down? <laughs> Damn right I win. Oh, what else do you think I do? Alright, here's the last boss. God, this guy's got a big ass head. Duck right under those missiles. Didn't hurt him at all, dude. Alright, 
Alright, you know what? I'm getting greedy by being on the side that he's on. I'm trying to, like, intercept him as he comes across. Wow. But I won't do that. I'll just, uh, I'll hang out on this side and hit him once. One, one time. One time at a time. What the heck, dude? Is he, like, what, invulnerable or something? I'm pretty sure that's the first time I've hit him. The animated just his nostrils. You pay attention to him the next time he's sitting on that pyramid or whatever the fuck that is. It's just his nostrils that move, nothing else. Oh, man. That's, it requires a certain, a certain timing that I'm not familiar with. I would prefer to finish this with 10 lives though, so we're gonna see. We're gonna see what I can do here. hurting him, because he's not, like, flashing or blinking or whatever. Do we have to hit him on the, uh, crown or something? Okay, let me try that. Kill the dude. What? Oh, he can hurt you from up there? This guy. So his moveset is like not even challenging in the slightest. It's just, this is boring to be honest. Dose, dude. Los dos, por favor. Oh, okay, sorry. I need to pay attention. Wait, what the hell? I, I just don't get it, dude. He's got like a hurt box on his nose or something? His entire body's a hurt box because that's the nature of this game is that when you touch enemies you get hurt. But um, I don't know, I just really don't get it. Alright, not too bad. Okay, I'm gonna mute it because uh, I'm gonna mute my mic. I think there's something I want to say. So yeah, um, sorry about that. I had to mute my mic because um, that last theme that played, I think that's something I could sample. Uh, I mean, I could always just beat the game again and then record it, but uh, if it's on the VHS tape, it's just easier to do. That's what I've done with some of the other Turbo Graphics games I've beat, like Silent Debuggers, Sidearms, stuff like that. Um, so yeah, uh, that's, that's it for this one. 
finish the game. Unfortunately, you didn't get to see the uh, snow level or the ice level, which is level two. Because I skipped it because I got 50 stars, or 50 smileys. So I think it was level three, but whatever. Anyways, so that's pretty much the entire game, and again, it was uh, not too challenging for the most part. I think uh, it was kind of more... Uh, I hate to say this, but it was kind of more tedious than anything else. <laughs> uh, but it was pretty chill. It's a chill game. Cool little platformer. Kind of a, it's like the Turbo Graphics and Mario, sort of. And I don't know, there's some other cool stuff that you can do that I didn't do, so... Definitely lots of possibilities with this one, but uh... That's... that's um, Box Revenge in a nutshell. We'll see if I get around to recording Box Adventure. That was the predecessor for this game, so the mechanics are a little bit different. And I think it's more challenging, but I guess we'll find out when I play it. <laughs> but yeah, special thanks, dude. Shout out to you for, uh, I guess, watching or listening to this. Um, and, uh, take it easy. <laughs> Later.